Okay, so this video is about these two receivers I bought from Banggood. Let's see if I can focus here. These are the RXF801 receivers that are supposed to be uh, free sky compatible. And, um, well, basically, I haven't been able to bind these receivers with any of my FreeSky equipment. I have the Tyrannus Plus, this is an EU model. And I have the FreeSky DJT module here. And I also have an old Graupner MX-12 and I've installed a DHT module in this. So we have the switch here and the the binding button here. So I'll just show you what happens. Let me start with the Tyrannus. Now um, I've inserted the plug here uh, on channel 8 so that basically I don't have to press the bind button all the time and um, I have power coming on from there so Welcome let's to just Act. fire up the Tyrannus and let's see Here, let's first use the external RF, meaning the DJT uh, module here. So I have these switches set to, let's see if I can focus, I have one off and two on, so it's basically in the one way mode so it doesn't have the telemetry on and here I have external RF set for PPM so let's put this into bind mode welcome to open TX there we go This. No. We have the LED continuously on, which indicates that it's in bind mode. And the DJT is flashing, so it's ready to bind. And it won't bind. I waited for half a minute for this and it just won't bind. Although it should bind in this mode. So let's try again. This time I'll just switch the DJT for the telemetry mode. Basically flick the second Dip switch down, and then power it up. There we go. And nothing's happening, it's not binding. Then we can try with the Tyrannus internal internal radio. So we'll just Welcome to Open TX. Switch 
that off and now seeing as this is an EU Tyrannus I only have this option available for me so I'm just going to select that then press enter so now it's wanting to bind Plug that in. So, Tyrannus is ready to bind, but, and so is this actually, but they're not talking to each other. So, Now that that isn't working either, we're just going to have one more shot with this. So, let's turn this off. Plug that. Now, for the DHT, we have this switch here. This is the three-way switch. It has the uh, one-way transmission, two-way transmission, and firmware update mode. So I'm putting it into the one-way transmission. And then push this button while I turn it on. So now it's in bind mode. that on it's ready to bind but it won't work with that either and it's basically the same with either one of these receivers so I read up on these receivers that they they have an updatable firmware and it needs a USB ASP programmer, so I ordered one uh, just to try with another firmware version because I read read up on I think it was RC groups. Um, the developer said that there's some problems with some transmitters, so that he's basically done some changes on the firmware to help with that so we'll see